Hello students. Good morning. Today we are here to learn something about linear equations. All you know about equations. You know that equations having two sides there is a sign of x equal to and to the sign of equal there is a left hand side lhs and to the right it is right hand side so either in both of the two sides or in any one of the sides there will be maybe expressions integers that means variables numbers integers etc so we have to solve given equations and find out the solution for the equation in previous previous classes we have learned about solving equations there are different ways of solving equations but today we will solve the equations by the general method or the most popular method by transpositions let take question 1 equation is x minus 2 is equal to 7 to the left hand side of this equation That is x minus two. X is a variable. Minus two is an integer. And to the right hand side of the equation, there is an integer seven. Solving an equation means you just have to find out. the value of the variable that comes in the form of number or integers rational number or fraction so by using the method of transposition we can find out the solution of this equation transposition actually means transferring integers or variables or any of the terms given in the equation from one side to the other side that means from left to right or from right to left as needed since in this equation we have to find the value of x so we can remove minus 2 from left hand side if we remove minus 2 from left hand side in left hand side there is only x remaining after that we put the sign of equal we remove minus 2 when minus 2 goes to right hand side
it becomes just opposite that means it becomes plus 2 first we can write 7 as it is already in right hand side now we transpose minus 2 to right hand side it becomes plus 2 so our answer is 9 this is the solution of the equation and this method is called transposition method let take another question here y plus 3 is equal to 10 simply we have to transpose plus 3 here remains y equal 10 and my plus 3 becomes minus 3 so y is equal to 7 these are simple equations and solution of these equations are very simple so try to solve as many questions from exercise 2.1 at home tomorrow we will solve some more equations Thank you.